Hi there, welcome to coachingmiddleworks.com. This is Abe Stone. I'm the life design coach here. Today, I have another video in the exciting series on breakthroughs, on how to achieve breakthroughs, how to orchestrate breakthroughs in your lives, and what are the three key elements that are uh, essential and are actually a natural part of breakthroughs occurring in our lives. I made an initial introduction video. Please check out the link below if you want to go see all three of them. Today, we're going to talk about strategies. And once again, we're basing this off of uh, Tony Robbins' uh, building and study of uh, a lot of this over the years. And it's, a, it's an amazing insight. Today, when we talk about strategies, what we're looking at is we're looking at plans. We're looking at the way you go about getting to something by sitting down and actually thinking through a process and using a process, using a strategy essentially, to get you from point A to point B. Okay, let's take an example. Uh, a few years ago, actually my whole life, I've, been, I've had a bit of a gut and I've never really been super happy with it, but it never bothered me. One day I decided, well, I gotta, I gotta get this thing, I gotta take care of this. I wanna be healthy, and that's a sign that I'm not doing very well. But a couple years ago, I decided, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get rid of my belly fat. I'm gonna get fit. Okay, so what do I do? Now, what I needed to do was I needed to find someone, find a strategy that was gonna work, and that was gonna work for me. So I did. Initially, I started with, um, some other programs, I don't remember which ones they were. The most recent one was Tony Horton's P90X series. And I was doing the one hour, I was doing it three days a week, and it was working really well for me. I was moving along, but then I realized I wasn't making quick enough progress. And I needed to fine tune my strategy, fine tune how it was gonna work. And he came out with a new video series, which was only 30 minutes. So now I do five days, five to six days a week for 30 minutes. And it's made a huge difference. And I'm working progressively towards my goal. I've had amazing breakthroughs. And I'm no longer uh, the sluggish old aid that I used to be. And the plan has really worked. I'm still looking forward to completely getting rid of, the, of my, uh, of my uh, gut. But it's well on the way. And the strategy is working. So here are... Uh, a few tips to help you with setting up your strategy for whatever it is that you're looking to change in your life. Maybe it's about money, uh, maybe it's about your health, maybe it has to do with business, maybe it has to do with relationships. Okay, so the first one is this. I suggest you just sit down and just have a brain dump. Just sit down with a piece of paper and write down as many ideas as you can. Even if they seem un uh, unattainable or not very doable or practical, just make a list. Make it a long list, as long as you can, so that you have a, 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 the resource to pull from. All right, now for number two, as you're looking over that list, you need to think about who has achieved what you want, who has reached uh, that success that you want, and who's teaching other people, who's training other people. Maybe it's someone in your life, someone who's close to you, who you could be your mentor, or maybe it's someone out there, like with the online world nowadays, there are so many potential people who can help you to reach your goals, who can coach you, who can give you systems, who can actually help your strategies come to life. So find someone who's doing what you want to do, someone who's going where you want to go, and follow them. Now, the third idea is write out a plan. Pick something from that brainstorm idea. See how it fits in together with the ideas of people that you've uh, come across, the ideas of the people that are going where you want to go, and sit down and make a plan for putting those ideas into action. You can look at my previous post on setting emotionally strong, smart goals in your life and use that as a guide for making your plan. The fourth tip that I have for you is just choose one action. What is your next action? And Get that very clear, and how you're going to get take how you're going to take that action, uh, whether it's starting on a certain date, uh, calling someone, uh, yeah, buying a certain product, whatever it is. I mean, you know the details of your personal situation, so whatever that action is, get it set up and start doing it. Preferably, I would suggest that you have an action that is a habitual action. Maybe it's a matter of. Uh, if it's, uh, you know, like in the case of exercise, doing such a certain exercise at certain times, setting aside so much time on a regular basis to get it done, okay? So decide on an action and get that action in place. And my fourth tip for really uh, getting a strategy in place and getting it going is start right away. Don't put it off in the future. I mean, sure, maybe you need a few things to get ready, but boy, action, immediate action, and massive action at that is really what's going to get you through to that breakthrough. So there you go. Five quick tips that I hope will help you to find the right strategy for you and make that strategy work for you. And now, here's your quote for the day. Who are you now? What have you decided to become? 
Make this decision consciously. Make it carefully, make it powerfully, then act upon it. And for the powerful affirmation that I want to give you, here goes. I replace my indefinite, vague dreams with specific, detailed goals and action plans. Well, I hope you find these five tips helpful. If you're watching this video anywhere else, come over and check out my website. I'd love to see you there and interact with you. That's where I'll post all these videos and you find more great treasures like this. I'm Abe Stone, the Life Design Coach at CoachingWindyWorks.com. Bye for now. Take care.